Hey, happy travelers. So we were getting antsy in the house. So we decided today we are going on a hike. Let's do it. Wow, you're good at this vlogging thing. <laughs> So this particular hike is not that far away from our house. It's only about like 10 or 15 miles, but I guarantee this hike in Los Angeles, you've never seen before. So just wait, it's gonna be awesome. We can't wait to show it to you. So we are going to the city of Palos Verdes and we are hiking to a shipwreck today. It's a very nice drive from where we live. It is 20 miles along the coast. So we get to be in the sunshine and look at the ocean and then go on a really cool hike. Now, before we get to the pretty part of the coast, we do have to drive through two ports, the Port of Long Beach and the Port of Los Angeles. Fun fact, the Port of Long Beach is the second busiest port in the US and the Port of Los Angeles is the first busiest port in the US. Well, not super scenic, it is kind of interesting to see all the freighters and uh, the trucks and everything, at least I think so. Rancho Palos Verdes. The trailhead to this hike is a little bit tricky to find. Um, it's in a neighborhood, but we are at the intersection of Paseo del Mar and Cloyden Road. Um, kind of this big intersection and let's see. The trailhead is right next to this big house. You kind of have to go down a little hill and then you make it to a really rocky beach. You're going to want good shoes for this hike. It's very rocky. It's right next to this house. Oh look, our first wildlife spotting. It's a wild Kevin. Kind of steep. Once you get to the bottom of the drainage pipe, it's only about a three quarter mile hike, so it's not that far, but it's on this really rocky beach, so it's a little bit of slow going. And I'm excited to show you what the shipwreck looks like because it's really cool. Follow me, I know the way. Let's go. There's bits and pieces of the shipwreck all the way along the coast. And one of them is right here that's kind of half submerged in the water. Check it out. I found it. Where is it? Ahoy. <laughs> you found it? It's down there. What'd you find? Ahoy hoy. A piece of shipwreck. Buried treasure. Very treasure. shark and it scared me. <laughs> yeah. So we've come across our first major piece of the ship. It's right here, this big rusty hulk of something. I'm not 100% sure which part of the ship this is. We're gonna go around this corner and then there should be a lot more of the ship to check out, which I will give you some info about it then. You can just see how battered it is and how rusty it is and all the rocks around it are super rusty too. It's pretty cool. Are you good on your tetanus shot? I hope so. Thank you. 
This ship was originally over 400 feet long, but pieces have been salvaged and taken away and the sea has scattered a bunch of pieces and displaced them all over. So there's just random bits and pieces that are left over now. A lot of mangled metal and super sharp shit that you wouldn't want to fall on. All right, so we've reached the So we finally made it to the main uh, debris field here. This is one of the bigger pieces. It's like almost completely intact. It's like a big winch or something. I don't know. So you're not going to believe me, but the name of this ship was the SS Dominator, which is just like the coolest name for a ship ever. It was a freighter that ran aground here in Palos Verdes in 1961. It was on its way to one of the ports and it got caught in some fog and had some navigational errors and it's been here for 59 years now. There are so many rusty jagged metal pieces just sticking out everywhere. That's another argument for the closed-toed, sturdy shoes that I made earlier. Oh wow. Yeah, you can actually see like inside here. One last big section that we haven't checked out yet, so we're gonna go take a look as it looks like it's about to get swallowed up by the ocean. Don't do it. No. Don't do it. We've hung out at this awesome shipwreck just about as long as we can possibly stand. We're gonna hike back and head home now. So I really hope you enjoyed coming along with us on this hike today. And if you're ever in Los Angeles, this is definitely a really cool thing to do. So as always, hit the like button and be sure to subscribe so you don't miss any more amazing things to do in Los Angeles or travel videos. This is The Awkward Tourist. Peace out. Let's go! Forward to adventure! Action!